team, get ready to burn and to sweat. Your first exercise, walk to plank, open to side plank, corkscrew, we'll alternate the sides. Beginners, knees on the floor, let's do it. All the way, reach up and over. So just like your regular corkscrew, but you open up to the side plank and you drive that strong extended lean arm all the way overhead, guys. If you need to be on your knees while you're walking, totally fine. Come on up, guys. Pick up the pace with me. We're doing the hip pilates style today. First three blocks without the weights. Then block number four, five, and six. We're gonna add some light weights to our workout today. Keep on breathing. And the last three blocks, we're gonna focus on core balance and strings. All right. Stay with me, guys. Your low impact today, as an option, of course, is your bear hover. You can just choose to walk around your mat. Breathe, guys. We can fit one more rep. Hold away till the end with me, guys, till the very last second. Dive into your bear hold. Beginners, you can do tabletop or again, walk around your mat. Keep on breathing, guys. Your next exercise is very similar. We're gonna go to the walk to plank. Legs through only one side at a time. Walk back, legs through on the other side. Get ready, guys. Set and join me. Ready, set. Let's crush this minute together again, all the way. What's important here, I want you to drive that leg under through your abs. Activate your abdomen in order to thread that leg through. Try to go with a straight leg, of course, if you can. If this is too much, I know you're super strong now, then put your knees on the floor, guys. Stay with me. All the way up, breathe. I can feel like my heart rate up is coming up. Breathe deep all the way through. Good job. Come on up. Finish strong. Drive that leg, remember, through those abs. Good job. Come on up. Nice and wide, guys. I'm so proud of you. We are so strong. We are so fast and furious. All the way, guys. Come on back up. Finish it. Last one. All together. That's it. Excellent. Back to your bear. Let's talk about workbook. Our workbook page today is for our optimism self-assessment for optimism. This is so important, guys. I can't stress about this quality in our personality as a human being, as optimism. So don't forget to do your workbook today. Your next exercise, walk to plank, single leg dog, knee to the nose. Get ready, set, here we go. One leg, walk back. Beautiful, come back. Leg, knee to the nose. Try to reach that nose, don't hit it, but try to reach this all the way. Big one. Other side, leg first, knee, come back. You've got this one. So fun. Come on up. Breathe. Leg, knee. That's not only your arm strength, your leg strength, but that's your abs too. If you drive that knee all the way through, guys, coming up. Come on back. All right, stay committed, guys. Stay committed till the very last second. Say, I can do it. We can do it. Come on. Last one. Excellent. Congratulations. Your first block is already complete. It's going to fly by super quickly, as always, with all of our workouts. Breathe, guys. Your second block is gonna be as well without the weights. Your first exercise is only one-sided. We're going to repeat this one right on the left side. That's your lunge. Then drive knee back up, take a look. We drive knee back up. Leg extension, option. If you have the balance, all right, guys, do your best. Start with the top, that's where we're gonna come back. We're doing only one side, one side for entire minute. Get ready, set, add the arms for intensity. Kick, take it back. 
drive that knee up kick step in between guys if you have to right here step good job reach lift drives that knee kick it out you've got this all the way lift kick top lift drive this is a challenging one would you rather you guys behind your toes right try to drive that knee all the way through from the lunge that's it that's perfect lift up give me great form guys you're super strong a lot to focus on lift that's it one more one more one more finish it excellent all right come on down very good we're gonna do exactly the same on the other side hold your bear or tabletop or book around come on back up just don't give up we work until the very last second from the first till the second get ready guys have always option hands on the waistline do not extend the leg tap more often on the floor just do your best ready set tap the toe other side here we go drives that knee up kick if you can drives that knee up kick if you can you don't have to touch the floor in between if you can drive it back that's it awesome a lot of balance here a lot of core you really have to breathe guys and you really have to watch the wide lunge because that's where intensity comes from drives that knee up all the way make an effort drive it up you've got this keep those arms extended and super strong if you use them no weak arms guys no weak arms that's it a lot of balance here we're gonna finish it last one i made it through it was challenging for the last few seconds come on down welcome back to your bear through the nose in through the nose out all right my friends come on back up i'm so so proud of you and your next exercise is your lunge switches on the tippy toes you're gonna step wider your tippy toes are optional come on up doing that on the tippy toes added an extra challenge you have to focus on your core while we're doing that let's talk about quality for the day is our optimistic attitude to this life have you ever asked yourself a question how do you see the half glass half glass of the water half empty or half full right you probably heard about it but that's a big indication if you see it half full or half empty big thing to think about so take your self-assessment for today something to think about a lot of questions to ask yourself then to reflect back knowledge is power only if you put it to work couple more guys we've got through together that was extremely challenging all right guys go back to your bear breeze congratulations block number two is already complete so quick so quick come on up i'm so proud of you guys drink your water we have one more block without the weights stay with me In this block, we will begin with a one-sided exercise. You're going to step back to your lunge again, but this time you step to your plank and do the leg pull front. We do one side only. Are you ready? Best form ever, guys. Here we go. Give me a good leg pull. All the way. Leg pull. That one back up. Step. Leg pull. Pull, guys, through your glute, all the way. Come on back. 
Give me a good lunge first. Step back, lunge first. Find the balance. Good leg pull. Don't swing, guys, right leg. But pull through the glute. Active glute, point toes. You've got this. Almost through. Time is flying, guys. Don't stop. Keep on working. This is a challenging one, especially if we're trying to go faster. We can fit one more. I got you guys. All right, back to your bear. Come on down. Breathe. My legs on fire, especially that one leg. All right, we will do exactly the same on the position, everybody. But we're gonna be using the other side. Get ready, guys. Keep breathing really actively so you have the oxygen floating through your body, giving your balance and strength. All right, ready, set. Join me, guys. Let's crush this one. Leg pull. Lunge back. Leg pull. Lunge back. You've got this one. Step wider, my friends. Good job. Focus. Focus on the balance. Focus on the balance. Focus on stability in your body in order to step to that lunge. That takes a lot of muscular strength, a lot of engagement. Every single inch, every single cell in the body works in order to hold it. You burn a lot of calories. That's it. We got this one. Till the very last second, guys. We can fit one more. Breathe. I think one more, what do you think? Yes. The answer is always yes. Back to your bear. Excellent commitment, guys, excellent. Come on down. Breathe, breathe, elbow, shoulder, one on top of another. You can be in your tabletop, you can walk around your mat. Just don't sit, guys, and do nothing. Breathe actively. Your next exercise, guys. Frogger to tippy toe explode. Low frogger and up. Get ready. Set. This is gonna be a challenger. Here we go. All the way, guys. I want to see you below the 90 degrees. If you can, of course. Because this is your frogger squat. Not just a plie squat, not a regular one. Tippy toes are optional. Legs on burn. That's it. Are you feeling it? I am feeling it so hard. All right, guys, stay with me. Lower than 90 degrees. Come on up. Keep those arms engaged, guys, engaged. Don't, uh, don't let those arms fly around uncontrollably or put them on the waistline. We got this one. Finish strong, guys. Finish strong till the very last second. I know. All right. Last one, guys. Muscle up. Excellent. So proud of you. Get back down. All right, guys. This is our longer break. Breeze. Stay with me, stay with me, stay with me. Couple more. Three, two, one. Come on up. All right. Block three is already, com is already complete. We're going to grab our light weights. I'm using three pound weights today, and you will understand why, because we're gonna do some exercises which require greater control. All right, drink your water. And your first exercise, only one-sided. Do it on your kneeling position in the tabletop, or we're going for the donkey kicks in the plane, guys. Get ready. Here we go. Pick up your belly, beginners, if you're doing it in the tabletop, totally fine. As long as you're having a great, strong donkey kick through that glute, you're working. Stay with me. This is a true burner for both legs. The one which supports the body weight and the one which is lifting the light weight. Higher, guys, higher, 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 flex the feet. Your arms working like crazy too. Stay with me. You can start in a plank and then finish, guys. 
in the tabletop if you have to. Stay with me, don't quit. Few seconds left. I'm feeling it for you as well, guys. Four, three, my leg is giving up too. One, finish strong, couple more, couple more, couple more, last one. Excellent. This was something, guys. Let's do the tricep this time. So we give our legs a little break. One more. All right. Choose to do it the same way you did the other leg. Downgrade when you can't bear it anymore. Make sure you begin strong, guys. Even if it's only a few reps. Get ready. That way, you're pushing the boundaries. You're getting stronger. You're exploring. You're getting stronger, guys, every single day by doing. But you have to push yourself. Come on. We got this one. Pick up your belly. This is very challenging exercise. Now you see why I choose only three pounds weights today for us. Or maybe even two and a half. Two pounds would work just great as well. Do not quit, guys. Distribute your body weight between all three points. Your one leg and two arms. Keep kicking, keep kicking the other leg up. Keep kicking it for good, guys. All right. Breeze, 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 guys. Do not give up, we're almost there. Almost there. Few seconds left, guys. Kick it, kick it, kick it, kick it. Don't quit, don't quit. Get on your tabletop, but don't quit. Three, two, one. Excellent. That was a killer one. You're gonna put your one dumbbell up front. Let's do a quick tricep. That's it. Perfect. Come on down. Your final exercise in this block is your roll up. Your weights, guys, are optional. We're going to roll up and lift the legs straight or for the beginners, knees bent. Whatever you can do, guys. Get ready. Set, come on up. That's it. Come on up, roll up. That's it. Make sure that dumbbell is really firm. Bend your knees, guys, if you have to bend your knees. This is a light weight. Easy to hold in between the feet, but not very easy to lift. We got this one. Hold it in between the ankles or just with the blades of your feet, like I'm doing right now. Come on down. That's it. Don't even think to quit, guys. Don't even think to quit. We're finishing block number four. Come on up. That was a good one. Come on, guys, last one. We got through this together. Come on down. All right, we're gonna go for the bear. And we move into the block number five, which is with our light dumbbells as well. Come on up. Your first exercise is one-sided. You can hang with me in the bear to down dog, single leg dumbbell underneath, or you can do down dog with a dumbbell or without and dive into the tabletop instead the hover. All right, guys. This is gonna be challenging. Only one side. We'll begin on a kneeling position. We really have to squeeze it. Get ready, work. Hold your bear, hover, or go to your tabletop. Lift. I want you to use your glute, and I need you to squeeze the dumbbell really, really hard. So you activate your hamstring, your Achilles, and you also stay in safe and sound with the dumbbell. When you go to your down dog or upside down V, guys, express through the back, keep the back nice and wide. Any time you need, you can put that knee on the floor instead of the hover. Work it. Breathe, guys, don't quit. We got this one. 
almost through. Few seconds only left, stay strong guys. We've been the best versions we possibly can be. And that version always changing guys. We're getting stronger, more resilient, more committed through life. Hopefully that's what we're working on, right? Breathe, breathe, breathe. All right. The same thing, but from the other side, guys. Make sure you're really squeezing it underneath your knee. It's nice and safe on the position. Choose to the tabletop. Let's go. I'm choosing to go the hard way with the hover. All the way. Don't forget, when you go to your down dog, Relax your neck, guys, just the same like we normally do. But keep that leg nice and tight, the one which is the holding dumbbell. That's it. We got this one. Breathe actively. That's it. Stay with me, team. Stay with me all the way. Stay, 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 stay. Finish strong. All the way till the very end. Couple more reps. We can do it. Last one, guys, last one. Finish it. Knee first on the floor. We're going back to the hover. All right, or choose to walk around your mat, guys. All right, come on up, guys, with me for the standing position. For the next exercise, we will alternate the sides. It's gonna be your knee lift around the world. Go back, come on up, and switch your legs. Get ready, set, here we go. Nice and quality. Find the balance. Come on back up. We switch the legs. Around the world, all the way down. Come on back up, light weights, guys. Just like you do your angel. Come on back up, tap the floor anytime you have to. Control, guys, control comes through trust in your body and of course breathing. You have to activate your abs as well. This is a big part of the balance. Not as much your legs are active here, but your core. We got this one. Come on up again. I'm so proud of you. You can't imagine how much, because I know how much stronger guys you get. Read every single comment, right? All right, Tim. Go back to your bear. Stay with me. Stay with me, guys. This is our longer break for three, two, one. We have one more block with the weights. So drink your water and we're gonna move to the block number six together. All right, this block, we will begin only one-sided. Go to your hover or go to your tabletop Begin, guys, we work in this one arm. The other arm is working as well, because it's holding. Anytime you will need to land back on your knees, please do. Long strokes, guys, all the way. Straight arm if you can. This is a light weight. If you have a shoulders injuries, you definitely want to do it in a tabletop and maybe even lighter weights. Do not quit, guys. This is the challenging one. Stay with me. We got this one. We got this, guys. Few seconds left. Fight till the very end. And last one. That was super challenging. Come on down in your bear, guys. We're holding it just for a few seconds so we can give our arms and our legs a little break. It's the same thing, 
other side guys stay committed do your best i'm not gonna let you down you ready guys set wrist elbow shoulder stack one on top another right try to hover the knees low you can always give yourself break when it's unbearable and put your knees on the floor then don't forget to come back all right let's begin all the way doesn't have to be fast Waist control, guys, it's a light weight. Hard on the legs. Not as hard with the arm, the arm with the dumbbell, but really challenging the arm which supporting the weight. That's it. Straight arm, guys, straight arm, the one which carrying the dumbbell. Straight arm. We got this one. Few seconds left, guys. Do not quit, you can always put your knees back on the floor. Couple more reps, can we do it? Say yes, I can. Yes, I can, come on guys, push it, push it, push it. Last one. Excellent. Dumbbell on the floor, that was amazing commitment, guys. All right, back to your bear. Activate. Upper arms, shoulders, and back. Come on down. Your next exercise is gonna be, guys, on your back. We're going for the bridge on the tippy toes, chest press. Wide grip to neutral grip. Your tippy toes are optional, guys, but that's gonna give you your glutes. Lift the hips. Here we go. Quick. Those are light dumbbells, quick. That's perfect. Lift the hips, guys, a little bit higher. That feels like a piece of cake after what we just did. All right. That's perfect. We more than halfway through, guys. Lift those hips a little bit higher, guys, a little bit higher. Concentrate on a good engagement in the core. That's perfect. Almost forgot which one I did, wide grip or narrow grip. Last one, guys. That's it. And final one. You've got this one, come on up. Hips down. We did it together. We're gonna go for the bear. Then we will drink our water and move to the next three rounds which we are focusing on core balance and stability. Your first exercise in the next block is gonna be your star side plank hold. We're gonna be holding for one minute. Anytime you would have to put your knee on the floor, don't hesitate to do it. If you rest before the minute is over, come back to your full side plank. You can do it. Wrist elbow, shoulder, arms up, three, two, one, we hold in. I know. Arms and legs will start to shake a little bit or a lot, which is very normal, especially after the what we already did today. Stay with me. Stay super strong, guys. Activate that leg. No weak legs if you're lifting that leg. You can always put the bottom knee, guys, on the floor if you have to. We're more than halfway through. Stay with me, guys, till the very end. Let's talk about optimistic qualities. Let's look forward when the exercise will be over. Come on, guys, come on, come on, come on. Super strong, super positive. You've got this. Look forward, look forward, not down. Few seconds left. Three, two, one. We got this one. Let's rest, guys. We need a little break. If you're ready for the bear, then join me. If not, walk around the mat. Don't just sit around. All right, guys. This arm is gonna be resting. We're gonna go another side. Do your best. Don't quit. We do it together. 
on a position. Remember, you can always put your knee on the floor. It's always there for you. If you recover before the time is over, then come back to the star variation. You can go back and forth between two. Stay, guys, stay, stay, stay. Make sure that the wrist, elbow and shoulder, one on top another. You're gonna feel it if it's not right. Stack the elbow, wrist and shoulder, guys. That looks awesome. Very good form, everybody. Stay with me. Don't forget to share with me how you did this one for an entire minute. If you suffer too much or just a little bit, oh my goodness, my leg, my arm starting to shake. Lift it up. We've got this one. All right, guys. Just a little bit left. Don't dare to quit. You can put your knee on the floor. My glute is on fire. Totally burning. The bottom leg. Come on back. That was something. All right, let's stretch the arms and we're gonna go to the bear. Come on back. All right, team. We do it together. We're not going to quit. Couple more seconds. All right, in this walk, we're gonna go on our belly. Don't get too excited because we're gonna go for a slow swimmer. Come on down. One arm, opposite leg at a time, on the position, here we go. Slow one, guys, slow one. I want you to feel every single movement. Breeze, where are we swimming? I don't know, Hawaii, maybe. Come on down, stay with me, stay with me. Around the world, we're swimming around the world. Entire minute, long time. Nice and slow, guys. Lift those arms, lift those legs. Active back. We're doing it together. We're more than halfway through, guys. Stay with me, don't stop, don't stop, don't stop your swim. Keep on swimming. That's it. That's it. A few seconds left, guys. That was awesome. Come on up. Stretch the back. Bear hold. We're holding for a few seconds, guys. And this is our longer break. We have two more blocks of core balance and stability left, guys. So drink your water, stay hydrated, keep your mood elevated, keep your optimism up and going, and we're ready for the block number eight. Your first exercise, one-sided. We're gonna go in down dog, bend our knees, work one leg at a time, bend your knees only halfway through. Our avocado measure, good name for this. Point your toes, guys, and try to produce a good quality circles. Good quality circles. Your back is long and extended, my friends. Weight away from the hands and shoulders. You bend that other leg slightly, just about 35, 45 degrees. Shoulder blades wide, collarbones wide. So that one leg is working, your hip flexor is working. Draws a bigger, bolder circle if you can. Stay with me. Very good, very good. You can do it. Few seconds left, guys. We do it together. And one more. You've got this one. Stretch the legs. Come on down. Hold your bear just a few seconds. Four, guys. Three, two, down. We do exactly the same on the other side. Remember, you bend that knee so this leg is working. This hip flexor is gonna work up in. Weight away from the shoulders. And hands. You ready? I'm ready, you ready? Bend your knees slightly. Scoop the belly in. Lift that leg. Weight away from the shoulders and wrist. Shoulder blades, guys, wide. Back is expanded and extended to all direction. 
eight directions and start to add the bigger border circles on that other leg. Press your hands really firmly, guys, into the floor and relax your head. Point your toes so your hamstring and Achilles is very active, guys. Watch the back, watch the abs. If you start to feel your wrist too much, you're probably shifting too much weight to the front. Stay with me. Together, guys, together. Bigger border circle. And breathe. Only a few seconds left, guys. Bend that knee so that one supportive leg is working. We got it. And last one, my friends. Straight the legs. All the way, shift the weight back. Come on down. Hold it with me for a few seconds. All right. Your next exercise, we will alternate the sides. You're gonna go hip dips in the side plank, knees on the floor, tricep push up, hip dips on the other side. Are you ready? Of course we are. Get ready, guys. Set, here we go. Knees on the floor, chest right in between, guys. All the way, hip dips. You don't have to go fast. I want you to feel each and every muscle. This is a core stability and balance. Challenge, knees on the floor. Dive deep, coming up. All the way. Coming up. Almost forgot my hip dips in the side plank. Stay with me, guys. Coming up. Watch your shoulders when you do your hip dips. That's perfect. Knees. We can finish one more, guys. Don't stop. Knees on the floor. Trice. Excellent. We're gonna go for the bear hold or walk around your mat. Stay with me, guys. Congratulations, your book number eight is officially complete. Come on up, drink your water, stay hydrated. And we are moving for the final block of this workout. All right, your first exercise is gonna be your rollover. For the beginners, you can roll over just by taking feet towards the ceiling. We come back, we lift the feet to the frogger, we hold the ankles. All right, guys. On the position, get ready, set whatever for variation of the rollover you're gonna be choosing. Make sure that you don't transfer the weight on your neck. You don't have to go crazy fast. I want you to maintain good quality control of your movement. That's perfect. That's it. Lift. Good work, guys. This is a challenging one after everything we did. Lift the chest, guys, on a seated position if you can. Beginner, hold your frogger feet on the floor. Coming up. For our low impact here, guys, we're gonna be holding reverse tabletop so we don't jump up and down. So it's very convenient to come back to the next exercise. Lift up, hips up, guys. Your next exercise is your Roll over to forward fold, back stretch, all the way. We're gonna go for the regular yoga style, back stretch. So get ready on the position. You can just finish your feet up towards the ceiling without rolling over all the way if you're not ready for this. Come on up. Back down slow, guys, vertebra by vertebra, reach over the legs. Give it a second or two, good quality stretches, don't hurry up. 
Lift. Come on back. Reach. Excellent, guys. We're almost through. This is a challenging one. When you come down, hold it for a second or two so you feel the good, great stretch. Last one, guys. That feels amazing for the long pack. We're gonna hold this one because it feels so good. Lengthen in the spine and fall forward a little bit deeper. All right, we have our final exercise, which is gonna be our seated position. Kroger, we're going to express, coming up. Our hip flexor, gently pressing on top, on the knees, like this. Hold it for a few seconds. Then we practice stability and core, holding the legs. Join me when you're ready. Four, three, two, come on back. And five, six, stretch it, seven. Come on back up. Caesar hold all the way. Scoop the belly in. Back to the seated, feet together. Press right on top. Come on back. I got you guys. Hold it, hold it. Take it back all the way. Finish off, my friends. All the way up. Back. That's it. We're almost through. Lift it nice and high. Come back. That's perfect. And come back. I think we can do one more. Final hold. And back down. Excellent. That was amazing commitment, guys. We're gonna go for the final reverse table top. And then we're gonna do some arm stretches and a few hip stretches in addition to what we just did. Lift the hips up. Four, guys. Three, two, you've got this. All right, let's extend one leg and take another leg across. If you can step across, that's okay, then you hold it where it is. We go for the half spinal twist all the way. Look behind the shoulder. That's perfect. We're gonna go and hold this leg where it is and just go to the other side. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Four, three, Two. We do the other leg, but after we go for our arm bind and forward fold. So take your hands behind. If you can't bind them, then just don't do it for now. But if you can connect them, we're going to fold forward and lift the arms all the way up and over. Just a tiny little back bend will work. I want you to focus on your arms and lengthening them all the way through. Hands away from the back. Come on back up. Take your other leg all the way across. And half spinal twist. Try to level the shoulders, right and left. We did an amazing job. You know, I'm so proud of you. I hope you know this, guys, because those workouts are challenging, sweaty. But you guys, amazingly strong people. Come on back. We're gonna go in our kneeling position. Put our both toes together, heels out, and pull forward. Great for the arms, for the chest, and for the back. Good for the hips as well. Four, guys. Three, two. Come on back up. We're gonna go for one more bind stretch. This time with a kneeling position, take your arms behind. You don't have to take them upside down if you're not ready. And just slowly, gently pull forward. Four, guys. Three, two, feeling so good. Come on back, bring your both knees together, tuck your toes, give yourself a gentle back bend, one side. Come on back to the other side. Hips forward, chest up. Come on back, guys, slowly. 
step wider. We're gonna go for the lateral stretches in a couple strong plie squats. Reach all the way in, all the way to the other side. Three, two, up and over the head. Excellent. Reach up, head exhalation, guys. Inhalation, all the health, all the healing, all the vitality, all the passion, all the optimism right about this life and reach all the way final time fantastic work guys great work amazing commitment do not forget to do your self-assessment for the optimism for our today workbook and rest well recover well and i will see you all tomorrow